From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good morning, everyone, and thank you for joining us here on this Tuesday morning. I'm student meteorologist Mike Susco with your Campus Weather Service forecast. Taking a look at our weather headlines right now, we can see today we will have cooler temperatures with showers arriving overnight. Tomorrow into Friday, we will have those spring-like temperatures that are continuing with showers possible all three days. And then this weekend, we will have sh showers and cooler temperatures as a cool front will be moving through the area come Saturday afternoon. However, right now, we see that we have clouds in the area over Beaver Stadium with the sun just coming over the mountain right now. And we see we have a high, uh, excuse me, a temperature at 36 degrees right now with calm winds. As far as across the Commonwealth goes, 36 degrees in State College and Bradford. However, Erie and Pittsburgh right now are at 48 degrees, which are our warm spots, but there is a possibility that some of the uh, areas around them could even be in the 50s already. But it's Allentown at 32 degrees. So we do have a pretty widespread uh, temperature gradient across Pennsylvania right now. As far as the radar and satellite goes, we can see that we have those clouds moving from west to east. That will continue throughout the day uh, to come today. However, first, in order to see any kind of precipitation from these clouds, you have to go all the way back to Michigan and sh the Chicago area in order to see it. So these clouds are not going to give us any kind of rain uh, s during the day. They're just going to make it cloudy outside, we but the rain will arrive tonight. As we can see from future weather, those clouds will continue to move west to east uh, during the day. The farther east you go, the more of a chance they will, that they will break up during the day. But tonight, we can see those showers will start to move into the area. And the best chance of rain will be tomorrow at six, around 6 o'clock in the morning around Johnstown area. But as the day goes on, those showers will start to dissipate more. And those clouds, the farther east you go, they'll start to break up more and more as you continue your way eastward. As far as today's forecast goes, you can see we have a high of 50 degrees under partly cloudy skies here with a south wind coming 5 to 10 miles per hour. For tonight, we do have a chance for some showers, particularly after midnight, with winds coming out of the south 10, 5 to 10 miles per hour with a low of 41 degrees. And then tomorrow, there is a chance for some showers in the morning. However, most of the day will be mostly cloudy skies with a high of 62. So this 60 uh, degrees temperatures will continue. Tomorrow, we have a southwest wind, or southeast wind, excuse me, five to 10 miles per hour. So if over the next seven days, we can see today partly cloudy with a high of 50. Tonight, we'll have a low of 41 with a chance of some showers. And then tomorrow, we have a high of 62. Most of the day will be mostly cloudy skies with a low of 46. Then Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, we do have a chance for some rain. However, Thursday and Friday, will we have highs in the 60s. Saturday, we'll have highs in the low, uh, 50s around 52. That's when our cold front will arrive and then Sunday and Monday a little bit more of a return to reality as far as temperatures go. We have a highs in the mid 40s with a chance of rain continuing uh, coming back on Monday. That's all we have for you right now. Thank you for joining us. I'm student meteorologist Mike Susco. Have a great day.